Hello everybody, this is Johnny Tabasco14 from both here on YouTube and yes, yes, my dying eBay store. I have a package. It is the fifth entry into my 66th birthday challenge, which does not end until August 31st. And uh, do, 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 do. I will show you her at the end. And this is something I made. Okay, my package is that. Look at this. This came from Chelsea, who you all know as Sugar Ray Crafts here on YouTube. And you know, Chelsea has a little store also, and I will have to find out the link to her store. I'm not, I think it's a Zibbit store. And um, when I find out the link to it, I will add it to the description below for you guys so you can go and visit. Okay, I'm just going to start to pull stuff out. All that was supposed to be in here was the entry for my challenge. But if you all know Chelsea, she's a sweetie. She has sent more than she was supposed to. I was looking for an easy way to open this. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Okay, here we go. I see a little piece of tape right there. Well, duh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ay, ay, ay. Sorry, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, my goodness, my goodness. I know exactly what this is. How cute. First of all, look at this tray. Oh, she even put felt on the bottom. Oh, how cute. She's painted it and put um, eyelet lace and then uh, uh, eyelet trim and then some lace over the top and some beautiful pink paper on the inside. Oh my gosh, Chelsea. Oh, Chelsea, thank you so much. I saw the video when she made this and showed this, and I told her how beautiful I thought it was and how cute. Oh, look at this jar. How cute. Oh, my goodness. And she's got a paper flower and some trim. Love that trim. Look at how cute this jar is. Wait a minute now. Oh no, this is how it opens. I was trying to open it from the bottom. Oh, that was pretty smart. I thought it was a paper flower. That's just to keep everything from falling out. <laughs> Sometimes I, my learning curve is slow. <laughs> it's not, oh my gosh, look at dominoes. Real old dominoes. Some beautiful flowers. Oh, how pretty. She's made these flowers. Some of this is like so cute. And put all the flowers. I, I hope you're seeing them. Um, buttons. That one's a sunflower. And look at this little birdie. Isn't that cute? Oh my goodness. Chelsea, this is so, so cute. All right, let me dump them out so I can pick them up. Oh, by the way, um, I absolutely hate my nails. Hate, hate, hate my nails this month. And it's it's certainly not my nail tech's fault. She always lets me choose. And this looked really, really, this glittery stuff looked really, really cute when it was in the package. But um, once it was on, I hated it. Hate it. <laughs> And I still have uh, two weeks to go because I only go every three weeks. In fact, I went on a Wednesday last time, and the next time I don't go until a Thursday because she had a little glitch. So I still have two more weeks to suffer. And I usually love my nails, always. And the funny thing is, is that I literally picked out blue. It's blue because... Um, Lisa, Maggie, um, 2005 Cupcake, loves blue. And I thought, you know what? Her birthday's coming up on August 2nd. I'll have my nails done in blue for <laughs> Maggie. <laughs> 
And, um, no, not this blue. Wasn't so pretty. Anyway, look, another jar. And all covered and with pom-poms. And inside, I'm not going to pull it out. Oh, there's flowers underneath. And there's this. <gasps> there, I got it. I didn't think it was going to be easy to pull out. Here's two flowers that Chelsea has made. Oh, so cute. And look at this lace. It has got ribbon. That's pretty cool. And it's actually sewn on, which most of the time it's not sewn on. And when you go to unravel it, the ribbon always comes out. Don't think I can get this back. Well, here you go. Isn't that cute? And wait, there's something else here. So, let's see what else this is. I'm probably not in the view. I apologize. Oh, how pretty these are. These are two little crystal salt, sh salt and pepper shakers. You know what? I'm going to put angel dust in these and set them on the tray. Can you see it? How cute! Let me let me tilt it that way so you can see. Adorable. Chelsea, that is so sweet. Thank you so much. She has them wrapped, she had them wrapped really, really well. And you know, they came in a bubble envelope and nothing is hurt or broken or anything as you can see. Oh, sorry. Oh my gosh, wait till you see this, guys. <gasps> How cute! I know she did a video, and I did not want to watch the video. I like to be surprised. She has a bird's nest with little speckled eggs hanging from this ribbon. And she has actually a domino here covered in paper, painted pink, and an angel glued to the front. This is so unique. I have never seen anything like this. Let me just see if I can show you again. Isn't that cool? Oh my goodness, Chelsea, this is wonderful. I just want to lay it right here so nothing gets hurt. That is so cool. And there's still one more package. Oh my goodness. Guys, I got a, another box from Lisa just a little bit ago. A big box with more birthday pro presents in it. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, here is enough. I see how this goes. You know, I told you, I've got that slow learning curve. <laughs> and this one fits right there. Can you all see that? How cute. Okay, and she's got paper stuffed in the top. First, let me show you. She's decorated the jar. Put some rosette trim. Oh, and some sequins. And a little butterfly made out of the, the, um, the trim with little wings. And inside, oh my gosh. Wow, Chelsea, you did such a good job. Is a thread spool or a cork? I'm not sure. I think it's a cork. Look at this. She has taken, I probably, uh, a piece of jewelry, I would imagine, vintage jewelry, and put that in the bottom with beautiful, beautiful, this is actually feels like it's actually fabric, little rose fabric, butterfly. Oh, this is so cute. Chelsea, my girl, you did such a good job. Thank you so, so much. I will put this on my dresser. I will fill it up with little items that I, I might just put little rings and things inside this because I want this on my dresser. I love this little tray. So, so cute. Chelsea, thank you guys. If you haven't already um, <clears throat> visited um, Chelsea's YouTube channel, it is Sugar Ray Crafts. And again, I'll try and find the link to her store um, and put it in the description box, be box below. So visit her store. Chelsea, your sweetheart, thank you so, so much. And again, this is for my birthday challenge, which does not end until uh, August 31st, so you got plenty of time. All right, now, just set that aside. 
if you all watched the video from Leslie's um, entry, she also sent me some birthday presents in there, some yummy, yummy things. And one of the things she sent to me was this fabric. This little kitty fabric. And as you know, as crazy as it is, I am a complete, complete Hello Kitty nutcase. <laughs> so, um, I thought, you know, I'll make a pillow or something out of the fabric. And then I started thinking of the Tilda bug and all the Tilda craze. And I thought, well, I will make myself a Tilda Hello Kitty bug. Now, here you go where you get a chance to laugh, you see. When I, <laughs> when I sewed this together, when I put the two sides of the wings together, I don't know if you can tell this in the video or not, but this is actually on this side, the inside of the fabric. I had, they were pinned together uh, with right sides together and I had to take one of them are apart and make the slit you know the slits like over here to, to stuff it and then um, after I made the slit I put them back together and didn't realize that this one had gotten turned the opposite way and I just started to sewing <laughs> and when I finished sewing I still didn't even really notice it because the slits on this side which is not showing so that it, I when I sewed it on I faced it so that it, the nice side showed front forward um, I stuffed it up and flipped it over and I was like Oh no. Okay, I thought I'll just leave it. <laughs> it's just one of those crazy things that happens. So, you know, as I say, all, all, all timers, well, I've got old timers. So, I keep telling people I'm at the can't stage, can't see, can't think, can't remember, can't hear, can't see, can't walk without tripping over something, somehow, someplace. The only thing that's not in the can't uh, column is eat. And so I still can eat and get fat. <laughs> so that's where I'm at with uh, my stage of life. Anyway, thank you so, 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 so much, Chelsea, for this beautiful um, tray and your... Um, beautiful beautiful entries and thank you Leslie for this fabric I hope when you see this Tilda bug it elevates your mood and makes you smile because it certainly makes me smile it is very very funny okay thank you so much for watching taking time out of your day have a wonderful wonderful rest of the evening remember no biting no 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 fighting be kind to each other so, share the love, give someone a hug. Be well, everyone. Pinkalicious hugs. Whoops, 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 whoops. Ciao, ciao, ciao.